Hello everybody, hope you guys have a good day. Today I'm going to show you how to exclude uh, shipping from tax in WooCommerce. So first, uh, before we are going to dive into the how-to, let me show you an example. When we have uh, the shipping cost is calculated in tax. So for example, uh, I'm logging as a, as a customer on my store here. I want to buy this one. It's 2008. $199 laptop and I go to view cart and sure enough you see that the base price the product price is 2899 and the shipping is 20 so put 20 and the shipping and the product price is 2919 and of course this is the tax I set the tax to 10% of the the cart price what if you want to calculate the the tax based on this base price only so that is what i'm going to show you now go back to our store you click on shipping here so if you have multiple shipping zones which is very common make sure you check all the shipping methods in those those zones to make sure this works so i have only one zone here so I click on edit on uh, this this zone and you see that I have two shipping methods here free shipping method and uh, that would be free so we are not going to pay attention to that but this is the standard shipping which is applied to our store here standard shipping so I click on edit and you see that there is a field called tax status and it, it is taxable so uh, I select none, save it changes, and I'll go back to the store. And if I reload this, you can see that uh, the tax price is now 10% of the product price, and the shipping shipping cost is not included in the calculation of tax. So uh, that is how you can exclude shipping from the tax. So if you want to include shipping in the tax you just do the reverse so that is how you can change the tax status for the shipping cost thank you very much for watching and uh, make sure to like and share and subscribe to my channel for more useful videos